What's up YouTube? This is Beautiful Nightmare 97 and I'm going to teach you how to play Crush 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 by Paramore. I'll, I will play a little bit of it for you so you know which song I'm talking about. And that's what I'm going to teach you for right now. Okay, I'm going to teach you what the tab says. May not be easiest, but this is what how the tab plays it. There will be palm muting, which is on the bridge. Bridge. You place your palm there, and you strum. That's palm muting. By the way, this song is in drop D. I didn't tune my strings, as you can tell, but um, just make this string sound like this string, and you'll be all set. All right, so I'm going to start off. The tab says to put your um, first finger on the fourth fret of the A, put your um, pinky on the seventh fret of the D, and put your third finger on the sixth fret of the G. You play that three times. And then you go on to the next part. Which is actually pretty easy to go on to the next part, but it's kind of hard if you just and you go on to the next part. But anyways, that's the way the tab says. So after this you go to 7 and 5 of the A and the D string of the that D string and that's palm you, you play that 8 times then you come up to the 3rd fret of the the E and A I'm, I'm just saying E so that you don't get confused and you play that 4 times then you come down to the 3rd and 5th of the A and D play that 8 times then 5 and 7 and you play that 16 times um, then you go up to the 3rd of E and A then 3 and 5 of A and D and you play it again that was the intro I've, I've got a lot to say to you and then you come to the pre-chorus, which you're just gonna bar. You're gonna bar the whole first fret, okay? And then you're gonna put your pinky and your um, ring finger on the third fret of the uh, D and G, and you're gonna strum all five of those strings. And then you're gonna slide down to the third and fifth, and you're gonna play that. Then you're going to slide down to the 5th and 7th and put your middle finger on the 6th fret of the B strum and strum that. That was the pre-chorus and you're going to play that part twice. And then that little part, um, do 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 do, that part, you're going to come down to the 12th fret of the um, E. And you're going to play 12, 13, 12, you're going to play 13 on the B, um, 12 on the G, then 13 on the E, and 12. And that was the intro and verse. And I'm going to teach you the um, chorus now. The chorus, nothing compares to a quiet evening yelling. That's open, open, then three. 
Then you're going to play third on the A and five on the B right there on the D and G. And you're going to strum all five. Then you're going to come up to the first and the third fret. And you're going to play that once. Then open, open. Then three and five again. Then open, open. Third. Three and five. Then you're going to come up to the first on those same strings and play that eight times. Slide down to the third and five and play that five times. And that was the chorus. Then it gets into the um, post chorus again. And I'm going to teach you that part now. That part is on the 10th um, fret of the B string. Right here. And you're going to play 10, 11, 10. Then 12 and 10 on the G string. Then 9, 10, 9 on the G string. Then 10, I mean, um, go up to the D string and play 12. And play 10 three times. First half. Then you're going to come back and play that again. Then the 12. And play 10 once. Then come down to the E string and play 10. My bad. And that's how you play that. And then you play the verse again. That's the um, palm mute, the three. I mean the five and seven. Palm muted, then the three, then five, three and five, back to seven, play it again, then three, then five and three, and again. Then you get back to they taped over your mouth. You play that um that part that rung. Then you play the do 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 do. After that you're gonna play on the seventh fret of the D and G. And you're going to strum those four strings twice. And then you're going to play the chorus again. Then you get into rock and roll. I have like two minutes, so I'm going to go through this really fast. You're going to play open once, then three, then three and five on the A, D, and G. Then you're going to play 8-8 eight, eight, slide out. You're going to play that eight times. Then you come to the final chorus, which is open, open, open. Then 3-3-3. Three, three, three. Then 5, uh, 10 times. 5 and 3. Then 1 and 3, three times. Then open, open, open. Then 3 and 5, um, 6 times. Then you're going to come back to that first intro part, the 6, um, 4, and um, 7. Play that 4 times. Then you go back into the second half of the chorus where it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then, then you play the regular chorus. Then you play the last solo. Um, I have a minute, so I'm going to go through this really fast again. Um, on the E string, Play 12, bend it, play 12, bend it again, then 12, then come to 10, T uh, 12, then 12, 10, 10, then 13, then you go up to the B string and play 10, 11, 10, wait, then 10 on the uh, E, then 13 on the uh, B, then 13 on the E, 12, 13, 15, then 13, then 15, then 17, 18, 17, 18, 22 slide out. And that's the whole song. Hope I helped. Please send requests and everything. I'll put the solo in the um, more info box since I went through that really fast. And please comment, rate, all that stuff. And see ya.